What up, y'all? We back. It's Friday. Y'all know what that means. It's payday for all my nine to fivers. Well, you know, everybody get paid on different days, but Friday is the uh, universal payday. What's popping, y'all? Real quick, since it's Friday, we finna get we finna get into it. We finna get juicy. Um, this for the parents. You ain't gotta be a parent. This mostly for the parents. I was having a conversation. Uh, my homie, my homie, uh, baby mama finna move finna move to California from Chicago uh, to a nice part of California too and me and him was talking about uh, he ain't want you know he ain't want his son and his daughter to leave but but we was really talking about it and I'm like man the the, the dude I mean you know his baby mama leaving with a successful dude they've been together for a long time like he a good dude whatever uh, the homie ain't got no issue with uh, with bro but it brought up a good question for me to hop on for me to hop on the vlog about right quick. Would you as a parent, would you rather if if you had the opportunity, if you know you was in the trenches, like you know what I'm saying, like Chicago, Philly, New Jersey, like you know what I'm saying, like some of these places, New Orleans, some of these places like the real trenches where where you know multiple people getting killed in the city every day. It ain't all just like 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 gang bangers. And, and, and people that's out in the streets, it's regular people getting killed, mistaken identity. If you knew, um, if you knew your child was in the trenches and had a chance to leave and go somewhere that was way better, go to better schools, experience better, like go somewhere where it wasn't no crime rate and stuff like that, would you just let them go, or would you want them to stay back so you could stay right there connected in their lives, but they in the trenches? Like for a minute, my homeboy was like, "Man, here rather." He'd rather be there and be present. And he said, you know, what well, he instilling his kid can protect them from, from the streets or whatever. But I'm like, I, I said, you could do all of that. But when you go to work or when they got to go outside and go to school or when they can't really go play, you know what I'm saying? When, when, when the friends that they got might might be associated with something that, that get them pop or something like that. You can't, it ain't nothing you could do about that. And you know, Money kept getting bought up, and it was like, well, you know, it ain't just about finances and stuff like that. But I'm like, man, we got to be real, bro. Uh, most of the time, it ain't that she would do for the money or nothing like that, because you know he a square, which is a good thing. But you know, a lot of times, when, when you got finances like that, when like real finances, it come from you having a certain type of mindset. It come from you being disciplined it come from you not being out there in them streets it come from you you know what i'm saying building credit so you know it ain't just about it ain't just about money but we got to stop acting like money don't change situations you know what i'm saying and stuff like that so like like for the mothers even for the mothers like ladies out there i really want you ladies to get in the comments because you know everybody say like a mother's bond is different if, if you had a father that was a good father really doing this thing taking care of his kids would be with them would let them live with him but he off far somewhere but, but you know he often he off in beverly hills or he off in malibu somewhere and and you in the trenches you know what i'm saying would you would you let your child you know go ahead and be with them especially what if what if what if your baby daddy got another kid and the and the siblings are close with each other you will, you will want you will, you will let one sibling you will let a sister two sisters you will let one sister grow up in in, in Beverly Hills getting this getting that not having the experience the trench while the other daughter still got to talk to her sister every day like be like man I don't, this going on out here I can't go outside my all my you know what I'm saying all my friends pregnant all all my guy friends getting shot up or woo 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 and all of that when they can be you know when they could be together would, would, would you let go? Would you let go to just let your child go on and have a better opportunity to 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 not have to um deal with the violence or not get wrapped up in, in no crazy stuff? Let me know. And and another thing that it kind of brought up is do money do do having money make more things acceptable? Like 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 we taking away the kids now. We taking away the kids now. We just going to the couples, ladies. If a guy really got you, if he really holding it down, mo you know what I'm saying, multiple vehicles that, that's paid for, he paying for, crib paid for, you know what I'm saying? I ain't going to say you got no allowance, but you could you could spend freely. You could do you. Y'all lifestyle is great. Do that man get away with more than, than the nigga that, that ain't got nothing going? 
that's always taking L's, that don't got nothing going for itself, you always, you, you taking care of him, you paying all the bills, you know what I'm saying, and all of that, do he, do he got less rope? And, and fellas, the same way. If your girl, if your girl doing anything, your girl holding you down, she paying for everything. She paying, she covering your lifestyle. Y'all not hurting. Y'all living good, but it's all for her back. Whatever she got going on, it, it's all for her. Do do you let that? Do you let her get away with more than you would a chick that you taking care of, that you doing everything? You know what I'm saying? How how far how far do that go? And and how far do you let? disrespectful things go because it's somebody that got some bread but i ain't gonna hold y'all too long man just please get in the comments and uh and let me know what y'all think if y'all ain't subscribed subscribe like and uh comment on this video hit that notification bell i'm gonna get it y'all later on the day